Hi, welcome back to EducateTube.com. My name is Sitsuki, your host. I did it! I finally be able to put my QX1, the APS-C modular camera, with an uh, 50 mil f 1.8 Sony lens onto my DJI Phantom 3 standard. I'm going to show you right now the clips, but it's cool. It can maintain this weight. This modular camera with this lens is only around 400 grams. So I already did the calculation. It should be able to lift it up. And uh, I was able to take photos. Now the video is a bit shaky. I didn't do any video. I just did the photo. So awesome, awesome selfie camera on the fly. And also you want to take any type of high quality, high resolution, beautiful, um, fabulous image using your APS-C camera. There you have it. Now the world first do it yourself APS-C camera with a beautiful interchangeable lens using the QX1 Sony camera and FE uh, lens 50mm f1.8 awesome let me show you right now okay as you can see here it's finished you have the QX1 camera hooked up to my FE uh, full frame lens this is a 50mm uh, f1.8 FE lens from Sony to its QX1 modular camera it is an APS-C camera. The, the whole unit, the, the lens and the camera just together, I think weighs between one, uh, 440 to 450 grams. So this drone, the DJI Phantom 3 standard, should be able to lift it up. So I create a base, as you can see here, a C-shaped base made out of um, empty toner car cartridge. Um, so I glued them together and so you see how it just sits nicely and then the camera just sits below that so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get started I'm going to turn on my QX1 uh, camera using my um, smart watch and then I have the uh, remote control to control the drone I'll just let it hoover the important thing is just let it hoover and then take a photo okay, let's see how heavy this thing is Oh, it's only 386 grams. So it should be able to be able to be lift up by the drone DJI Phantom 3 standard because like I said, I think the spec is that you should be able to lift about 2.2 .2 pound or close to 1.1 uh, kilograms. But I wouldn't go more than 500 grams. So we're going to test it out and see if it can carry this camera. I think it can. 386 grams that's not bad at all it should be able to lift that no problem okay we're ready to go and see what happened okay so here's the setup there's my smart watch controlling my camera the QX1 with the lens and then here is the DJI remote controller to control my DJI Phantom 3 standard all right let's get started uh, yes it's gonna be hard for me to record this, but I'm gonna put it right here. Okay, as you can see here, this is the picture I took from my QX1 camera attached to my DJI Phantom 3 standard. It's quite good. Now, the only problem is, of course, it's overexposed. I haven't adjusted any of these settings. For example, the exposure, the ISO, the shutter speed. I let the compute, uh, the camera does the, the rest. But in, in the future, I probably have to play around with the camera setting, the QX1. But you can say it's quite good. I'm very impressed. So for photography, this is amazing. Um, I'm going to do more uh, photo later on, but this is the one I was able to take. It only took me about uh, a minute or less to set it up. And here you can see I'm zooming in, and you can see my uh, face. Uh, it's quite clear. So in the future, I will show you more of what it, 
is able to do in terms of uh, uh, photo quality. Next time, I'm going to hook up my laser projector and we'll see how cool it is. Thanks for watching. Educate2.com. Come back and enjoy.